The newly expanded and renovated Fergus Falls Public Library is thanks to a multi-year-long process. It was designed and built with community participation and leadership, guiding the way to a new and unique facility. Roughly doubling the size of the library, BTR architects worked alongside library stakeholders in the city, along with the full inclusion of a diverse set of library patrons and friends. This included young and old, artists and tech enthusiasts, environmentalists, business people, cultural groups, and readers of all interests. The new library was designed with a special focus on young people and their families, building for the future using sustainable practices, adaptability, and the efficient use of resources, emphasizing the character of both the community and local landscape. The form and materials of the library connect visually to neighboring buildings and local landmarks. New wood trusses that were added match the original timber roof framing. Preservation of memorable elements like these from the past enliven the experience of library visitors by connecting with history while the new fully dimmable LED lighting fixtures call attention to the modern. Several relationships made Fergus Falls Library a success. For example, the partnership with local utility Ottertail Power was formed to design for energy savings and a commitment to Minnesota's B3 and SB 2030 energy standard which is meant to significantly reduce the energy and carbon emissions in Minnesota's buildings. Performance is measured in a number of categories, such as site, water, energy, indoor environment, materials, and waste. Fergus Falls Library utilizes a high-performance building envelope that will minimize heating and cooling loads on the mechanical system, while simultaneously providing for views to the outdoors and natural daylight throughout the interior. It does this with controls that dim the light fixtures automatically, where the natural light is abundant. The sun control fins on the west-facing windows shield the interior from the glare and additional heat that arrive later in the day. The light shelves on the interior bounce light deeper into the building. Balancing the daylight through the building are newly added clear story windows called light monitors. These face north in the vaulted ceiling, bringing daylight deeper into the building without additional heat. The landscape along the west face of the library acts as a stormwater collector that can redirect the water to the detention and treatment field that the city has created across the street. Stormwater isn't the only thing flowing underground though. A new geothermal heating and cooling system runs beneath the east parking lot, which includes a loop of 24 wells running 300 feet deep. This system has helped the building be 52% more energy efficient than comparable buildings. The advanced heating, venting, and cooling system includes water source variable refrigerant flow systems throughout the library. This system uses small refrigerant pipes instead of large air ducts to move energy around, allowing for smaller plenum spaces and the vaulted truss ceilings. You probably walk right by it and not even notice, but this bridge carries all the refrigerant pipes from the equipment room to the rest of the library. The HVAC system also uses quiet and efficient electronically commutated motor fans, which supports the library's acoustic environment. The acoustic performance is also enhanced by discrete panels along the walls of the vaulted areas in the new children's library. The colorful wood slat ceiling and walls also integrate an acoustic mesh all along the path to the children's library. Another feature that would go quietly unnoticed is the use of environmentally safe carpets and adhesives that don't pollute the air in the library. And humans weren't the only living creatures considered at Fergus Falls Library. Bird safe windows were added to the high risk zones, like these corner windows. Children, teens, and adults of all ages are welcome in areas dedicated to reading and creating playing and researching, connecting online and meeting in person. And at Fergus Falls Public Library, they'll be able to do so for decades to come.